How are you guys doing? This is Joe from Joe's Mods. I thought some of you might be interested in this. What we have here is a 351 Cobra Jet. It's been 430 over. It's got ARP studs. Uh, Compression is 92 to 1. It's got 351 Cobra Jet heads that were redone. And what I did is I took a 351 Windsor out of a uh, 95 F350 crew cab dually 4x4 and converted this motor over to fuel injection using an Edelbrock intake, put 24 pound injectors, stock um, computer, and it ran for quite a while until uh, I had a cam, one of the lobes on the cam got flat, so I got to take it apart and put a new cam in it. I'll probably put a roller cam in it. Um, I'll show you what I did for the uh, sensors and stuff. Um, I had the front pulley system was all from the 351 Windsor so you can convert uh, Cleveland over uh, the flywheel is a 28 ounce uh, flywheel from the Windsor uh, 351 Cobra Jet or Cleveland is 28 ounce balance so you're able to use a flywheel um, it was an automatic E4OD trans that was in there it bolted right up to the Cleveland engine mounts were the 351 Windsor engine mounts those bolted right up use the 351 Cobra Jet exhaust manifolds and put a dual exhaust on it and remarkably you'd be surprised how much would bolt up from a 351 Windsor to a Cleveland so I'll show you the different uh, sensors and where I put them okay, you need a engine cooling temperature sensor which is right over here so I put that over there the intake manifold I drilled out the intake use the fuel rails from the 351 Windsor which actually put the injectors at the perfect uh, angle for 351 Cleveland and then um, I use I made I got some brass bungs from PEX which the injectors fit right in and I JB weld them in I never had any issue with any leaks on the intake it worked out perfect so I ended up using the distributor from the 351 Windsor and I had to change the gear on it then I made my own uh, adapter for the throttle body and the throttle body is off of a 4.6 Triton engine TP sensors right here uh, air idle air bypass control was back here which is off right now <coughs> and like I said uh, the flywheel that's on here right now is a Windsor flywheel and this motor was probably putting out about 375 horses maybe 400 horses I had to make this adapter because the uh, fan is reverse for rotation on a Windsor and on a Cleveland it's forward rotation so I made that bracket to change it to a forward rotation and ran the serpentine belt a little different. The serpentine belt from the Windsor, the pulleys, they all worked. The only thing I had to do was drill out in the head right here 
and tap it so I could get the bracket on that side so it can be done uh, fairly cheap if you put spend a little time and you can do it with JB Weld and you can't even tell I JB Weld the intake after I painted it smoothed everything out ran like a champ 